Hello friends, Nicole from Adisoft. In this quick video we will show you how to make uh, labels that are not automatic in uh, QGIS. Let's say that uh, you have uh, your zones there, in this case uh, this uh, polygon there with different symbologies and as you can see the label, this circle with two lines, is placed uh, at the center of each feature. But in other cases where we have many features like this one and it is a multi-polygon feature we need to place it differently, not in the center like here it's placed perfectly but I want it to be somewhere around here. We can of course go to the settings of the layer by double clicking on it and in placement you can uh, see what options do we have. We have uh, inside visible or whole polygon, that means visible means that it will change depending on where I am zoomed in. When I zoom here it will place it uh, inside the visible polygon and uh, it floats. But that doesn't solve the problem. In the end when I see the whole polygon the result is exactly the same. It places them at this side. I don't want that and I will show you how to solve this issue. Let's uh, assign the whole polygon and force point inside polygon. That will be the general setting. And now we will change the distance from the this point for each feature individually. By default all features that I am satisfied with will be left with uh, zero distances. That means the label will be placed as it is. But on features like this one, that I'm not satisfied with, I want it to be here or this feature. I want not it not to be here but somewhere around here. For features like this, I will place it manually. Let's start. Go to the attribute table by right clicking and uh, open attribute table. And uh, I will create a new new column. First I will delete uh, some unnecessary columns here. Okay. And I will create a new column. I will call it uh, text and uh, the length will be 10. I will need at least 10 symbols. The name will be label distance. Okay. And by default for all features I will fill, go here to, this is uh, the field calculator, I will click on the field label distance and update all fields with uh, 0 0.0, 0, 0 0.0 and uh, close it. That will update all of our features with this value. Update all. That means by default the features labels will not be displaced. Now I will go to the offset x and y column. You can see that we have two values. And here I will specify the field which controls these uh, values. Field type and I will go to label distance. Click on apply. OK. Nothing changed because I typed zeros. But you see what happens now when I change. For example, I want this circle to be somewhere around here. That means around uh, 25 meters below on, on both sides. Let's go to the attribute table again. And uh, for this feature, you see it is selected. We will type 25.0, 25.0. And you see it, it changed its position. I want it even more to the southeast. That means I will change it not to 25, but 55.0, 55.0. And that will again move it, and that's where I want it. And uh, we change it uh, for this feature. We can change this feature as well. It's roughly, let's say, 500 to Y coordinate and it's actually minus 500 because I want it to go up, not down. And uh, X coordinate will be minus, let's say, 200. Let's see what happens. 
you can also check this option to always go to a selected feature. Let's type minus 200, this will be x and comma minus 500 and you can see the problem the field uh, has not enough uh, space that's why I will redefine the field by first I will discard this again I will go to the fields and I will delete the fields create a new field in this, ca this case I will type the name will be the same label this and I will go for 20 spacing and again I will update it date all for this feature I will go with the same 55.0 comma 55.0 and for this feature I will type bigger number minus 200.0 comma minus 500.0 and let's see what happens where did it go in the case where I'm I'm not seeing it I see it it is here from here it moved to here we need to move it uh, even more let's say and the point is that uh, by doing this uh, you change the label position for all layers for all um, for all uh, not layers for for this current layer but for all zooms that means if I am zoomed like this I will not see the feature it is out but if I zoom here it is always in this position and because it is scale dependent when I zoom too far in it will disappear and let's change it minus 500 and minus 1000 and that that is perfect that is exactly how I want it to be and just uh, save the layer settings and uh, you see the labels are exactly on their places and that will be perfect especially considering the scale of the drawing which is 1 to 25,000 so thanks for watching that's how to quickly change the position of uh, the labels for a polygon point layer or even line layer and uh, some features will have specific label positions. It's Nico Olive from Adisoft signing off and wishing you inspiration in your geographical practice.